遵守他的法度，一心寻求他的，这人变为有福。诗篇一百一十九，二。Devotional. What does it mean to be blessed? We all want a good life. We all want a life that is blessed and successful. Almost everyone on earth is searching for that. And we all have our own way of attaining the life we want. Some people look for happiness and fulfillment in material possessions. Others try to find happiness through get, gaining success and fame, and others search for fulfillment through relationships. But rather than following the paths of of the World around us. Psalm 192 tell says that true happiness and fulfillment come from obeying God, since God is the Creator and the ruler of the universe. He certainly knows what is the best for us. Following God's guidance and the direction for our life is the only way we will find true fulfillment. And the writer of Psalm 119 says that those who seek God with all their heart will be blessed. A blessed life is a happy and fulfilled life, but it's also a life that doesn't find ultimate happiness and fulfillment through anything on this earth. A truly blessed life comes through God. You were created to enjoy a relationship with God. The more we seek God and desire Him, the more we will find a truly blessed life. Because a true blessing comes from spending time with God. Prayer, God, I want to seek You with all my heart. You are my everything, so let my actions match my words. Each day, help me to draw closer to you. Guide me through each decision, and inspire me with new dreams and pursuits. I want to honor you in all that I do. In Jesus' name, Amen. Scripture. 遵守他的法度，一心寻求他的，这人变为有福。诗篇一百一十九，二。Blessed are those who keep his status and seek him with all their heart. Psalm one nineteen two. Welcome. You matter to God. Draw near to Him today through prayer. Honor God. 神说，不要进前来。当把你脚上的鞋脱下来，因为你所站之地是圣地。出埃及记三五。You are standing on holy ground because the Lord is with you in this place. Take a moment to give Him glory and the praise. My concerns. 我留下平安给你们。我将我的平安赐给你们。我所赐的不像世人所赐的。你们心里不要忧愁，也不要胆怯。约翰福音十四二十七。Imagine God hands you a gift, His peace. In return. He asks you to give him your worries and concerns. That may seem crazy, but that's exactly what God wants from you. Think about that as you talk to him about what's on your mind today. God's will, not my will, but yours, be done, now and always. Align my heart with yours. And change the way I think. Make me aware of what you are doing around me, and give me the courage and the strength to take part in developing your kingdom on earth. 
In Jesus' name, Amen. Closing, pause. God is with you and for you. Allow that truth to inform your thoughts and decisions throughout your day.